Hey y'all, it's Abby from Oklahoma Postcard. Um, couple things, again, I feel like I always start out my videos <laughs> saying a couple things. Um, okay, so I don't have my computer. There were some problems with it, so I took it into the tech support on campus and they have it. And that means no editing, so that means pretty bad quality video and no intro or anything like that. And it'll be back to normal by tomorrow. I'm not tomorrow, next week. Um, so yeah, that too. The title of this video is Losing Faith. And I um, was just wanting to talk about that in a broad aspect to me um, for my own personal benefit. Me talking about losing faith is literal in that lately I've really felt like I'm not close in my relationship with God and to those of you who don't know me very well I am a Christian but I think that being a Christian and learning about Jesus and Christianity can apply to a myriad of different things and also you don't have to be a Christian to watch my channel or agree I completely love learning about other religions other perspectives everything so that's awesome but um this week i just wanted to kind of be honest and vulnerable and say that i lately have been losing faith and i don't feel close i haven't been talking to god i haven't been been reading i haven't been taking any sort of responsibility in my faith and it's a scary feeling to feel like you're losing something that holds a lot of weight to you. And to you, that might be losing a zest for your job. You might be losing fire in your relationship, like with the person that you're with. Um, different stuff like that. And I just want to kind of give a couple insights to how I do well in that situation or if I can put work into it um and just a couple tips but please know that I am figuring this all out I don't know anything about this but uh just whenever I feel that way I like to talk to my friends that are in my women's ministry delight I like to talk to them I do still pray even though it feels more like a job sometimes whenever I'm feeling like I'm losing my faith and I think a lot of people whenever they feel like they're losing a fire or they're getting burnt out on something um, it feels like work and I think in that time you need to remember the good things about the thing that you're fighting for and you need to use that as fuel to push you into make you work. It takes work. You're not always going to want to do it, but it pays off. So I think talking to people, being honest, vulnerable, talking to people, reading for me, that means reading even though I don't want to. Sometimes listening to worship music kind of gets me going on um, my reading or my quiet time. Um, for other people that might be feeling lost in a relationship or feeling like they just are lost in general just fight for it if it's worth fighting for and I think you're going to know whether or not it's worth fighting for fight for it put in that little bit of work even when you don't feel like you want to and just fight and it'll slowly come back and it could be very slowly and um just really evaluate what, whether, I'm sorry, whether it's something you want or not. And if it's something you want, just fight and spend every little day getting closer and closer to where you want to be in whatever situation you want to be in. Try to take a positive light to it. Try to be encouraging to other people. Believe it or not, even if you aren't feeling it, you can be encouraging to somebody else and help somebody else and that can maybe build you up. That's a big reason that I wanted to start this channel is to find some consistency and find some light 
no matter what every week and just push through whatever I have going on so that maybe I can help someone else. Maybe it can end up helping me. So for me, I was flipping through my Bible and trying to find a verse that kind of is helpful for me in this situation. And some of my friends that I know maybe struggle with losing their faith, but also just people that are losing anything that they just need to get back and they're trying to rein it in as best they can and they're just having trouble. And I found, uh, let's see, what is it? It is Ephesians 3, 20 and 21. Now all glory to God who is able through his mighty power at work within us to accomplish infinitely more than we might ask or think. Glory to him in the church and Jesus Christ through all generations forever and ever. Amen. So for me, that just shows that no matter where I'm at in my relationship with God or where I'm at with my faith, no matter how inadequate or just undeserving I feel, he knows that I am capable of much more than I do. And that is the same for you guys, that you are capable of anything. And sometimes you just got to sit and just be like, I have no idea what I'm capable of, but I'm going to put in this next step and I'm going to put in this next little ounce of whatever I have to get in the right direction. And I just think if everyone just started believing in themselves just a little bit and just started not being complacent, that's the worst thing. If you feel like you're lost, the worst thing you can possibly do is be complacent. Just take a step and be fierce. Just go out and be fierce. Grab whatever you want and take it. That is all you can do and that is all I want you to do and that's all I'm going to try to do and I'm going to try to be better about it. I'm going to try to be better in my faith. I'm going to try to be better in life, in my relationship with my friends, in family, everything. I just think it's it's not worth it if you're not striving for something. So that's kind of my rant. <laughs> I'm kind of getting nervous because I don't have the capability of editing, so I feel like I'm probably babbling a lot. Um, yeah, so next week, come rain or shine, there will be a normal Oklahoma postcard video with all of the editing, and I promise it's going to start getting better and better with my editing. I'm just kind of trying things out, and I really love it, so I'm going to keep trying to do that. Um, yeah, so sorry about this kind of weird video this week, but it will be back to normal next week, and... I hope that you guys just experience this journey that you're on and you feel the hard times because it's going to make the good times feel better and you need to respect yourself every single time you take a step forward. Even if you don't, be on your side and be your number one fan and be excited for every day because you are capable of the world. And I truly believe it. I don't know who watches my videos. I don't know, but I hope there are some people that watch it and really get something from this because that would be amazing to me. So I hope that you guys are having an amazing week. Just go out there, be a light, be a light to yourselves, and I'll see you next week. Bye!